Virginia State Senator Cree Deeds was in critical condition, but has now been updated to fair condition after being stabbed multiple times in the head and upper torso Tuesday morning. Gus, the senator's 24-year-old son, was found shot, and state police are investigating whether he turned the gun on himself, looking at the incident as an attempted murder-suicide. Authorities say there was an altercation between the two men at the home that they share while no one else was there. When first responders arrived on the scene, Gus was still alive but ultimately died from his injuries. Authorities have not revealed who called 911 but say they are working adamantly to piece together what happened. Investigators are working right now on confirming the motive and the exact sequence of events. There's still a lot of work to be done and we'll release more details once we're at that stage where we can, we can confirm the facts. Virginia State Police posted more info on its Facebook page after the press conference, writing, Senator Deeds left the scene on foot and walked down the hill of his residence and was spotted and picked up by a cousin who was driving along Route 42. The two drove to the cousin's residence where the 911 call was placed. Senator Deeds was flown to the University of Virginia Medical Center where he is being treated. Police are not looking for any suspects at this time. If you know Virginia politics, you may know that he ran for the governor of Virginia against the current governor back in 2009, but he lost. And Gus took a break from school to go on the trail with his dad. In a statement, Governor Bob McDonnell said, The news from this morning is utterly heartbreaking. Cree Deeds is an exceptional and committed public servant who has always done what he believes is best for Virginia. The Richmond Times Dispatch reports Gus Deeds underwent a mental health evaluation Monday, but was released because no psychiatric bed was available across all of Western Virginia. Gus was one of the senator's four children and his only son. State troopers are at the hospital with the Deeds family to provide support. Deeds is alert and has spoken with investigators, but authorities will not elaborate on what was said. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.